DDT, and then the eagles ate lots of them in order to survive. So, big. and then what the DDT did was it thinned the layers of the eggs so they would actually crush their own eggs when they were trying to sit on them. So that's where we started losing those. A lot of our birds of prey, um, but the eagles and the um, osprey were both very highly impacted. So they did start reintroducing them. Um, a gentleman called uh, Tom Cade, I believe it was Tom, um, associated with Cornell Lab of Ornithology, started a very major program of reintroducing various raptors around the world. And some of the early, he was involved a little bit with the program here, but I can't remember the person with the DEC that was heavily involved. And for a few years, we had a pair that was here. We were encouraging them and we were making sure that they were, you know, they were giving us one, usually about one juvenile a year. Then those juveniles will frequently come back to the same area if they found, you know, good eating and feeding. And so now we have juveniles that come back here year after year um, and some that come from other areas and they hang out in areas of the refuge that you and I aren't going to get to today and 